We have a very nice car lineup here today at Autogefühl, your number one resource for in-depth car reviews and your number one community to discuss cars with Thomas. And we also have another special episode because it's about the pictures that you have posted. And recently I've, um, you know, told you to post some more pictures, especially on Instagram, and that worked very well. We had some really marvelous shots and I want to present them to you today. And later on, I mean, if you've watched the episode and also want to send in your pictures, always just use the hashtag Autogefühl. All the details are in the video description, no matter if you put some pictures on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook or whatever. So let's start with Mohammed, and he sent a beautiful pic of um, Mercedes S-Class. It's a W220 S600 from the year 2001. Massive appearance. Then we got Connor as well, I'll just speak the names as they show on Instagram, might not be the real names. With a nice Jaguar F-Type, that's the one we have here now, right after the car wash. Always take care of your cars. Then James sends us his, I guess it's Infiniti Q50, also at, uh, after an intensive car wash. That car wash theme seems to be, you know, pretty popular right now. <laughs> oh wow, this is a dream Passat, a Passat Alltrack, and this one was bought after seeing our review. Glad we could help there, and definitely a Passat Alltrack is you know, also one of my favorite Passat versions. Patrick from Germany. Hallo, viele Grüße nach Deutschland. With his massive Honda Civic Type R. Yeah, let's go racing. And the Civic Type R will also soon be in an Autogefühl review. Richard with his magnificent Scirocco from Volkswagen. With, oh, with contrast orange mirror caps. Like, that looks fancy. Of course, we have also reviewed the Scirocco a couple of times. Then we got Mungo with this classic Mini. What to say? I would say just classic. From Huma, we got a German outbound pick with, well, most certainly looks like a Skoda Octavia. Also one we got here right now. Is it Octavia? Just comment me. And also some Mercedes C-Class headlight, I guess. Maybe his dream car or is it also his own one? Put me that one in the comments. Then Calvin delivering us his Volkswagen Tiguan in front of the Sion National Park. Wow, such an incredible place. Just look at that landscape. And probably this is not his Porsche, but also it's really an awesome one. From our friends at Drive EV, best greetings to our colleagues. Covering electric vehicles, by the way, great site. We got a BMW i3, because they're obviously focusing on that one as well. Then TV Otava, or whatever that nickname is, showing us his outside workshop. I really admire people who can still do you know, so much on their own with their cars. And um, we can see here that he's changing uh, something with the brakes, I think. And um, well, it's just great how much technical on the thing he seems to be. Um, and obviously not only having a Volkswagen Passat, but also an Audi A4 or maybe S4. Looks like an S4. And he also got that some Lamborghini shots here, obviously, like, thank you. Then Cetos Clauer, great Master 6. Past and present comparison. You see how automotive design goes there. Very interesting. And I'm um, always looking great that into you know when you see that car evolution. And he's also showing himself. Way to go, man! Show us yourself more often, guys. That's really great. And also a beautiful landscape we've seen here. Well, where is it actually? Here was snow as well. Give me the info about landscape that is. And this another car from it, well, it seems like a wrapped Ford Fiesta also some very unique work. Then Humo is sending us some incredible desert pic. Wow, with this Nissan off-road vehicle. What of kind of desert is it? Seems to be somehow, you know, maybe it's some, somewhere in the Middle East, I'm not sure. Tell us more on the info, so wow, a really awesome pic. Then from Jack we got another classic, the original Beetle. Is that yours? Designed by Ferdinand Porsche, by the way. And, um, well, probably most of you know that. And then, whoa, that looks familiar. Mark posts his Audi A7 at the Guincho Coast in Portugal. We're quite often there to film some new reviews in such a beautiful place directly at the coast there. Then Dusan, he was his collage of this Alpha 147. Holger, one of our team members, he had that car once. And definitely a very beautiful car, even if the 
taillights, you have to switch them like once a year. <laughs> and then we finally have received a video from Matt, a video, and he is launch controlling his A45 AMG. I have linked that video in the video description, so check out that one, very nice. And glad we could also help you with that purchase decision. And finally, last one for the day, we got Donomoko with some hot Audi A5. Thank you very much again for your pictures. They were really inspiring and so much variety we got in there. And keep sending us those via all the social media channels with the Autogefühl hashtag. Thank you very much for taking part and we'll see us on our next special Autogefühl episode.